After a late night at the theater, let me tell you, it was worth it. I still have those songs going through my mind. The songs of Smokey Robinson, Diana Ross and the Supremes, Marvin Gaye, Stevie Wonder and the Jackson Five running through my head. Motown the Musical opened in the Music City last night at the Tennessee Performing Arts Center and we're thrilled to have a couple of the stars of that show with us right now. We have Chester Gregory and Shante Carmel. You got it. Great to have you all with <laughs> us today. Welcome. Thank you. Thank for you. Thank you. you. Welcome back to Nashville. Have yes. you been here before? I should have asked that earlier. Have you been here before? I have. I was here with Rent some time ago. We oh, were you? Okay. That. All right. So I should have chatted about that because we I probably were. saw you. But my wife and I were watching the show last night. And I'm going, where have we seen you? Where have we seen you? But <laughs> Dream Girls and Sister Act. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. 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 So let's talk about this show. Number one. Talk about the opening night last night because both of you all were pretty pumped about how great the opening night went here in Nashville. Yeah. Yes. So yeah. talk about I that. I love Nashville. Nashville is a great city. We're, we're here in the songwriting capital of the world. And so like, you know, there's um, no audience to me that so far, I'm new to the show. I've only been with the show about five weeks. Okay. And so far Nashville has been our greatest audience in terms of like response and being right there with us and celebrating the music, having a great time. I mean, last awesome. night was the perfect opening. Good, good. What do you think? Oh, I loved it. Mm -hmm. Lots of energy, lots of people. Woohoo. And I have a big number. And mm -hmm. like when I yelled out Nashville, the crowd was like right there. They were like <laughs> so stoked. So yeah, we, we were all it. And that's one of the great things too about this show because we all know the song. We've all sung these songs and danced to them before, as best as I can dance. Uh, but we've all danced to them before. So when you're singing these things, people are singing right along with you. Do you feel get a, a, a rush off of that energy from the audience? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. We. Um you know, there's a lot of, so the show is set, but then there's a lot of play that we have with the audience mm -hmm. as well. So when they're responsive with us, right there with us, it just keeps the energy of the show just going easily. You know? All right. Yeah. So let's talk about you for just a second here. You play Barry Gordy <laughs> yes. in the show. Talk about that because it's someone that's so well known and this mm -hmm. iconic figure here and everything. So talk about that and talk about auditioning in front of the man. Yeah. Uh, so I got a chance to meet him exactly about a year ago uh, at the L.A. opening. And uh, so I was anxious and nervous to meet him. You know, it was my first time. And mm -hmm. I even posted that day. I said, I'm, I'm seeing Motown, the musical, for the first time in L.A. I yeah. hope I get a chance to meet Barry Gordy. And boom, I got a chance to meet him. And little did I know, like about four or five months later, I get a chance to audition for him. And, you know, so by the time I got to audition for him, I'd already met him. So I was able to calm down a little bit okay. and just focus on the work. And he was very approachable and real cool guy. Yeah. Good, good. Now you, you play Martha Reeves and you play uh, Edna Anderson. Anderson. Yes. Did you ever meet Edna? I didn't. No, she, I know she just recently passed here last she June. She passed right before I was cast. But she was uh, an assistant to Barry. She was. Talk about playing her and Martha, but also you auditioned at Barry's house. I did, all by myself. It's uh -huh. like a really unique experience because I live in Los Angeles and usually they cast the show in New York. Most of the people come from New York. I'm, I'm both, me and Chester both came out of LA though. Mm -hmm. But I think they were, I was the only person they were seeing in LA and Barry only had so much time. They were like, have her come up to the house. It was me and a company as his assistant in his living room singing dancing in the streets uh -huh. <laughs> so it was uh, it was a really unique experience like i loved it and at the end of it all he looks at me and he sits back and he's like okay uh -huh. you won <laughs> Which, <laughs> to have that validation yes, yeah. to have yeah. that validation from barry gordy is like none other now i guess after a while you get used to the to the numbers and everything but are there times when you're backstage and the the other songs are going on and you're back there dancing and wait a minute I'm about to go back on I got to get myself together again <laughs> all the time absolutely yeah uh -huh. this is one of the best catalogs you can ever mm -hmm. Uh, sing and celebrate day after day. The songs never ever get old. Mm -hmm. Like, you know, we grew up singing this music and I've sung these songs in other shows and now I'm doing it eight times a week yeah. and every day it's fresh and these songs are so great, well written yes. and uh, well orchestrated. It's it's a celebration. It's new every time. Yeah. Awesome. Well, it's great to meet both of you. you so Welcome much. back to the Music hey. City. Good to have you all with us Thank today. You. Yes. And enjoy the rest of your time here in Nashville Thank through you Sunday. So much.